Hi guys, uh, Kyle again here with the headlight bulb removal and installation. Uh, I'm going to skip, uh, make this a short one. I don't need to do a 20 minute video on how to change a HID headlight, but um, this, uh, this will take a little shortcut. There is nothing on YouTube. I looked all over, but I finally figured it out. As you can see, I'm at the point where I need to put the bulb in. Uh, to get to this point, you had to take the, I first started removal of the, uh, the cowl for the grill. I did the removal of the two bolts here to get the back pulled out. I had uh, two, two uh, seven millimeter here. I had a seven millimeter here that connects to here. And I had one, you can see that clip down there. There's one there. Then I had to come around, crank the tire in, remove your, remove your trim, and there's a bunch of torques in here to get the quarter panel out. And then hidden away, way up in here, uh, I don't know if you can see it, but there is a bolt right here, or was, that uh, detaches the corner of the clip so you can pull it away. And once you pull that clip away, there is one more for the headlight removal. Um, that's right here. So technically, one, two, three, one, two, three. There is five uh, screws, seven millimeter, that takes off your assembly. Uh, the plug is here. It's already unplugged. And you can put pull the whole assembly out after it's unplugged. And everything's loosened up here. You got to pull that quarter panel away a little bit. And bingo, that's how you get... There's absolutely no way to put a bulb in this. Uh, it's not like the Volt. There's no way to put a bulb in here unless you take the whole assembly out. And this is the... I'd have to look it up. Let me look it up for you guys. I'll find you the exact um, headlight. They're not cheap. You can find some $30 ones on there. This is the D3S bulb or the R, whichever one you want. Um, and this is the bulb right here. It, it's a HID it's called. This whole assembly comes out and you plug in. That's just four screws. Uh, you put the new one in and you're good to go. I've got 111,000 on this. Three months ago I noticed uh, one of them turning off and on. I'd have to restart the lights to get it to work. Uh, but last night the right one started doing it. So I've been driving around three months with the bulb that's kind of going off and on. And you want to do them at the, the same time, otherwise you'll have to go through this again. They are separate circuits, but uh, replace them both if you're going to do all this work. They're uh, 100, uh, 150 each, and uh, yeah, I guess they'll be good for another 100,000 miles. Um, but that's the, the breakdown. The left side's exactly the same. Same deal. I'm going to have to dig into the quarter panel and then uh, buckle it all up. Little, little more tedious than your average bulb, but that's how you do it, guys. Chevy Bolt 2017 to 2020 uh, removal and reverse the installation to get it back together. Thank you.